Oh, didn't see that. As you can see, we're on the coast of England here. It's a World War II, a World War II ship. Um, it's been left there from the, from the war. It's been there for about 80 years now. We're here because over in the distance is Dunkirk. Now, you work this week's on Dunkirk. The evacuation of Dunkirk is quite close to my heart because my great granddad was actually a soldier who was evacuated in Operation Dynamo uh, to get him away from Dunkirk to save his life. Now, we need a bit of background knowledge to go with it. In 1939, September, the Germans invade Poland. They marched through France quite comfortably with the Blitzkrieg tactics. The BEF is sent to France by the British government, the British Expeditionary Force to help France, to help Belgium, to help Holland defeat the Nazis. The Nazis advances so fast through the top of the Ardennes that the British and French and Belgians are trapped on a beach like this one, over 300,000 men at Dunkirk. And the British think the best chance of saving the soldiers is going to be at the point of Dunkirk, sending over boats, warships, fishing boats, Light, uh, light, light different types of ships, all to try and save our soldiers. We're now, I'm going now going to go through a bit of details about Operation Dynamo and what actually happened. The war's over. We might have to then negotiate a peace deal because our entire army is going to be wiped out. The Americans aren't involved yet. The Russians are still on Hitler's side at this point. We are on our own because France is about to fall against the Nazi threat. Time is of the essence. The British are stranded on the beach. As you can see, there's not a lot of shelter. None at all, really. Um, the Luftwaffe are flying over, they're trying to kill all our troops. There's a lack of food, okay? There's not a lot of ammunition left to, to try and even shoot any of the planes. We are now on this beach, easy targets for any Luftwaffe bombers to completely wipe out, out our army. The war's only really just begun, okay? We've got, in theory, we've got another five years of fighting ahead of us. So we now, we need to get these troops back as quick as we can. And this is, the whole thing now is all about the Dunkirk spirit. Trying to rescue these troops is going to be what's going to be known as the Dunkirk spirit. What's going, I'm going to explain now are the results of the evacuation. What were the results of the operation? A success, or Churchill spun it like that, a triumph at Dunkirk. Over 338,000 troops were rescued from the beaches. Britain could live to fight another day. On the 4th of June, Churchill did his famous, we'll fight them on the beaches speech in Parliament. Dunkirk was over, the Battle of France was over, but the Battle of Britain was about to begin. <laughs> 